Hello everybody, Swami Nath here. Today we are going to see interview questions on enterprise structure, that is organizational structure in SAP MMS for now. Normal question and basic question. People are, uh, they are not able to answer this normal basic questions. So that is the reason I'm just uploading this video. First, let's get into the subject. Enterprise structure or organization structure. What is the organization structure in SAP They may ask you. Plant, purchase organization, storage location. And company and company code. Company, company code will be created by functional consultant, financial consultant, FICO consultant. And finally, a purchasing code. All the four consist of SAP, MM, enterprise structure. This is what the expected answer. If they are asking you what is the enterprise structure for SAP MM, this is what the expected answer. Plant, storage location, purchase organization, and purchasing group. All the way. Apart from company, company code. Company and company code will be created and maintained by FICO consultant, finance and controlling consultant. This is the expected answer. Next question. What is a plan? It's Your answer should be, it's an organizational unit wherein the manufacturing of goods will be happening in the plant. And it will be stored in storage location. Manufactured goods are stored in the storage location. It's an organizational unit, organizational unit where manufacturing of goods happens. That is what the definition for the plant. This is what the plan is. Next question. What is the factory calendar in a plant? A factory calendar, your expect, the expected answer is we have to, it's a in the plant, we select factory calendar. For example, it is based out of the region, the factory calendar will be selected. For example, if the factory calendar in India, if the fa factory is in Chennai and another factory is in Mumbai, for Chennai, a separate factory calendar will be created. For Mumbai, another one more separate factory calendar will be created. Because for in Chennai, Pongal will be a holiday. But in Mumbai, Holi will be a holiday. So in order to differentiate these two dates, they create factory calendar and it will be created by human resource consultant, HR consultant, HCM consultant. That is what factory calendar is all about. This is the expected answer. Next question. What is the storage location? It's a place where raw materials are stored for material management. Separate storage location will be created for raw materials. Separate storage location will be created for finished goods. Another storage location will be created for semi-finished. And another storage location will be created for consumables. So this is the this is the storage location goods are stored. This is the storage location definition. This is the expected answer. They are asking you what the storage location in the interview. Next step. What is a purchase organization? It's a group of people who are involved in purchasing activity. The conditions, conditions will be created. Contracts will be created by the purchase organization. Conditions and negotiation will be happening in the purchase organization from the vendor, from the supplier. So the negotiation will be happening with the supplier. That will be done by purchase organization. It's an organization unit that manages all purchasing activity for us. This is what the expected answer for the purchase organization in the interview. Next question. What is a purchasing group? What is a purchasing group? Purchasing group nothing but a person or a set of person who are involved in procuring, procurement activities. In the purchase organization. That is purchasing. It's a group of people who are involved in purchasing activities. In the purchase organization. This is the expected answer. Purchasing group are nothing but a person. Who is involved in negotiation, who is involved in the conditions, who is involved in signing up the contracts with the supplier? This purchasing. Purchasing. This is what the expected answer. Next. Assign purchase organization to plan. What is the relationship there? Question is what is the relationship between purchase organization and company code? Many to one. Many purchase organization to one company code. One company code can have multiple purchase organizations. This is what I expected. What is the relationship? The question will be like this. What is the relationship between purchase organization to company code? Or company code to purchase organization? May one company, many purchase organizations. This is the expected answer. Next step. Purchase organization to plant. 
What is the relationship between purchase organization to plan? Many to many. Many purchase organization to can, can be assigned to many plans. That is purchase organization to relationship. They may ask you this, this, this question in the interview. This is what the expected answer. Many to many. This is the expected answer. Next. What is the standard purchase organization? That this question, most of the people, they don't know what to answer. Several purchase organizations procure for certain plant or a plant. And you can define one of them as a standard purchase That is the answer. Several purchase organizations procure raw material for certain plant. You can define one of them as a standard purchase This is what they and this is a very important question, and it's our most important. They may ask you this question. Very, very important. People don't know what to answer. Next, reference purchase organization. This is also most of the people they are they don't know what to answer. Reference purchase organization can create contract for other purchase organization. Reference purchase organization can create conditions or contracts for other purchase organization. And one of them can be reference purchase. This is what the This is what the major questions will be asked in organization structure and SCP in the interview. Thank you.